Hi guys, welcome back to Elite Tech Media Alternative. So Intel launches low cost Celeron CPUs based on Scalic architecture, Core i3 6098P and Core i5 6402P to hit market in 29th, 29th January. Intel has launched the latest Celeron CPUs based on Scalic uh, uh, micro, micro architecture. The low cost chip aims to provide decent performance for entry level built office PCs, HTPCs. The Celeron family will be part of a desktop lineup which includes three chips the Celeron uh, G3900 uh, and Celeron uh, G3920 and the Celeron 3900T. After launching several high end Scarlet chips in the mainstream lineup on both desktop and mobility fronts, Intel is now planning to release low a uh, range of low cost entry level chips on the market. These include the i3 Pentium and Celeron chips which are, which were announced a couple of weeks ago and would not be available in the market for purchase. The new chips include three models which are already mentioned above. So we are going to take a close look at specification of, of the low cost CPUs. I, I wonder if they um, if you can overclock them. All all three chips were announced back in, uh, in October 2015, but Intel didn't launch them until now. The lineup ha has the Celeron uh, G3900 uh, as the base model, which is dual core clocked at 2.9 GHz, that comes with 2 MB of L3 cache, a 51 volt uh, TDP, and the Intel uh, high definition graphic. Um, 510i GPU. The Celeron um, G3920 is also similar in specification but comes with a faster uh, clock speed of 2.9 MHz. Uh, the Celeron uh, G3900T uh, is also a dual core model with 2 MB of L2 cache and a high definition graphic uh, 510 chip. However, comes with a 2.6 GHz clock speed, the benefits of this CPU is, the, is that it has a TDP of just 35V based on the Celeron uh, G3900 and uh, G3920, the price of just $42, while the Celeron um, uh, 3900T has a same price of $52. US dollars. All, all three chips are comparable with, with LGA 1151 socket to support DDR4 uh, 1866 megahertz and DDR3 1600 megahertz memory. Intel would be releasing the previous announced P-series CPUs in the market. The lineup includes the Core i5 um, 6402P, which is quad-core CPU, no hyper-trading support, featuring a base clock of 2.8 GHz and frequency boost of of 3.4 GHz. The chip comes with 6 MB of L3 cache and has a TDP of 65 volt. Previously, Intel uh, uh, Intel uh, processors that, ca that came with the P's something didn't feature any integrated uh, GPU uh, processor. This Core i5, uh, however, does come with a uh, high GPU. The graphics side is powered by a high definition graphic file. 510 chip that's clocked at 950 megahertz. The second C uh, CPU in the lineup is the Core i3 6098P, which is dual core chip with, uh, with hyper trading turned on. The CPU comes with a base clock of 3.6 gigahertz, but doesn't doesn't have any boost clock. The CPU has a TDP of 40, 55 volt and comes with comes with 3 megabyte of L3 cache. The chip also integrated on high definition 510 chip that's clocked at a higher frequency of 1050 megahertz the, the cpu comes with ddr4 ddr3 l memory support 2133 1600 megahertz and it's comparable with the existing lg 1151 motherboards the core i5 698p view retail price of 107 dollars us dollars wide the while the Core i5 6402P will retail at a price of $182. While both chips aren't uh, un unlocked to support overclocking, motherboards makers have released BIOS hardware that allows overclocking on non -CP of, of non unlocked CPUs on their motherboards, which makes entry uh, i3 CPU a real good idea. Uh, good deal. 
both processors will be launched on 29 January. So you can see you can see the sort of a table comparing all these guys here. Not too bad actually. Nice to see like budget friendly chips that are coming out on the market. But anyway, um thanks for watching guys. Please stay tuned for more latest news. I'm trying to keep up with everything and make videos and edit everything for you guys, save you guys reading and hustle finding um, different articles and different news. So thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe for more. Thank you. Peace.